LB squad. So here I am trying to give you guys consistent content. And here go YouTube messing me up, right? So I have this video that I've been trying to upload for the past uh, eight hours. See, there it goes. YouTube is acting up. So if I'm not consistent with my, with my content, it's not my fault. It's YouTube. YouTube is doing me dirty. But anyway, I am going to go grocery shopping since Lord knows when this is going to upload. So... I really feel like eating Chipotle, but because there's no Chipotle here, that means that I have to... I gotta get creative. I gotta DIY my Chipotle. So I'm gonna go to the grocery store, and I'm gonna bring you guys with me to the grocery store when while I go shopping, so you can see what grocery shopping is like here in Panama. Uh, first things first, I need to make sure I have my money. I don't... Hmm, maybe I should bring my little... Uh, Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm not gonna bring a purse. I'm gonna bring my little thingy thingy. The thing that you put around your waist. Yeah, that. The word is fanny pack. So ever since I've been quarantined, I've been like low-key and not wanting to bring purses. So I walk around with that little purse, but then it's easy for me to lose it. So yeah, fanny pack. So before I go grocery shopping, you want to make sure you have your recyclable bags because we don't use plastic bags anymore. So you have to have recyclable bags. So I am in my car, right? So usually, don't mind this back here. There's some merchandise that I never took out, the, out of my car because I don't have any like space. However, the grocery store that I usually like to go to is called River Smith. However, River Smith, sometimes the line to get in because of we're in quarantine and we have like a lot of times where we can go uh literally like the line be like ridiculous well, you know, the lines is usually like around the corner but it looks like it's gonna rain so if it rains then i have more of a chance to go in there because river smith smells sells more like american products you can find more things and the customer service there is a1 versus if you go to the rain <sighs> i don't yeah i don't know about that they have like limited stuff in there and the customer service is like really not that great, to say the least. But I'm gonna go check River Smith first to see if they have, if I can get in. If I can get in, that would be great. I would be so happy. So we shall see. So well, guys, I'm pulling up at the grocery store and the parking lot is ridiculously Crowded, which more than likely means that there's going to be a ridiculous line to get in which really sucks because they have the best stuff in here like they have my vegan cheese <sighs> oh my gosh they have everything in here I'm trying to see if there's a line because if there's a line I'm definitely not even going to step foot in that place I'm like being so honest right now like, I just want to go in, get my groceries, and then leave. <sighs> you know, Corona is really getting on my nerves. Really getting on my nerves. The only time that it's not crowded in here is when it's raining. If it's, if, when it's well, because of what's going on and because we're all on lockdown. Um, but if you want to come on a day, if you want to come and it not be crowded, you have to come when it's, like, raining. So I figured that because it looks really cloudy outside and may just rain that there wouldn't be a line and guess what there is a line guys i'm not even going to lie so because the other grocery store was super crowded and i ain't got time sis don't have no time i'm just gonna go to the other one that has really bad customer service because literally there is never a line there hence i mean bad customer service no customers um i'm just gonna go there because I just need to grab some stuff real quick. Well, I really do not want to go here, but at this point, I really don't have a choice. So, I guess... It sucks. But, what are we going to do, right? So, the rule is, is that in order to go in the store, you have to have your mask. Um, or else they won't let you in. And then they have to, like, take your temperature and all this other stuff. So... I'm going to put on my mask. 
And then I'm also going to make sure I take my hand sanitizer in there with me. Because, you know, it's just real. All of this bitch. It's real. And then you just want to take your bags. Because if you don't bring your bags, they're not going to give you any plastic bags. And you're going to end up having to buy these, which adds up. Don't be like me, guys. And it's going to rain and I don't have an umbrella. So I'm just going to make sure that I bring my little hoodie. And that's what we're going to do. So it is super empty in here. And I left my list at home. So. This is like the best taco season. The chicken tacos. I was looking for the small uh, black beans, but don't have those, so we're just gonna have to go with these. I usually always get coconut water, and you wanna check for the expiration date because sometimes these things be expired. And then this is our favorite drink. We only love to choose one bottle, so I'm gonna choose this. See what it says here. You can either choose six, a case of six, one wine, or one li one liter of liquor. So that's my choices right now. So I am back in my car, and I just want to tell you guys how much I hate that grocery store. Like. God, I just the level of customer service there is like non freaking existent. Like I can't stand going there. But because the one that I love going to is super crowded, I had to just humble myself. You know, eat a, a slice of humble pie, a slice of humble pie, and deal with the nonsense. First of all, they barely have anything in there, um, but that drink that I love to get. Um, but I guess for the sake of me wanting Chipotle and making Mexican um my diy chipotle this will just have to do so i am leaving now and i'm going back home so you guys already know that this is my diy uh chipotle so please do not try to come for me okay so this is my meat okay i'm not even going to use all this uh chicken breast but you know i already washed it but i like to put some apple cider vinegar on there to get rid of all the bacteria and all the germs okay because we don't do that we clean our chicken okay let that marinate just a little bit I'm gonna wash that or i'm not going to use all this chicken at all actually so i'm just going to take out some and then put the rest away i thought i had like bigger ziploc bags but i don't so now i have to use this so actually got it all in this little basket. I mean, this little Ziploc bag. It's gonna save the rest. I'm gonna use this taco season, guys. This taco, chicken taco season is the bomb. You hear me? Bomb, diddy, bomb, 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 dot com. So because I'm only using like two pieces of chicken in here, I'm not gonna use the whole thing. I don't wanna waste it. Now I'm gonna save the bags. So then I'm gonna let that marinate a little bit i'm gonna let that marinate but you know what since i'm gonna use my air fryer let me tell you guys if you guys have an air fryer i'm telling you like the air fryer is the best thing that happened that's been invented since mankind do you hear me this is the air fryer i have okay absolutely love this air fryer like i literally use it for everything so I'm gonna go ahead. All right, oh, I forgot to tell you guys that this, I actually split the chicken in half because it was super thick, but I'm gonna go ahead and put it in the air fryer. And it fits evenly in here. And then I'm gonna set it, oh, it's not even plugged in. I have a lot of stuff over here. All 
right, so I'm gonna actually set it for the timer. I'm gonna set it for 400. And I'm, it's gonna be set for 20 minutes. See, the good thing about this, it tells you like if it's chicken, how much you should set it for. And then I'm gonna let that cook by itself wraps that I bought like whole wheat um, I told you guys that I had to go to like the other uh, supermarket with the line of mare, which I don't really like too much because they really don't have everything but so I had to get this brand of cheddar I usually get the vegan but they didn't have it at that grocery store so I had to get this I don't know what it tastes like I don't even know what brand this is but we shall see. We shall see how it, how it comes out. It's almost done. It's literally at 3 minutes and 14 seconds. Cause you know Pamela don't have no chipotle. So this is what my plate looks like. I'm actually, I mean, it may not look as good as chipotle, but it'll get the job done while I am here in Panama until I can get back to New York. Um, so um, I hope you guys like this video, but I am about to tear this food up. I'm about to tear it up right now. And I'm about to watch some Netflix. So see you guys next time.